It's that Z, too low, no, she my flow Yeah, 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 it's that Z Hello everyone, I'm back with another video and in today's video, it's gonna be me and VIP Wa An Hong versus Vot Bim Natak and Formula Quail. The, the, now, the map of choice will be the Desert Cross and before we start, please give this video a thumbs up, subscribe on my channel and turn on the notification to not miss an upload or stream from my channel. Now without further ado, let's go ahead and dive straight into the battle. Okay, here it goes. Alright. Okay, now we're gonna have to fast forward a bit for us to get into the good part. Okay, gold scouting, getting those containers. Same thing with VIP Wa An Hong. Okay, I was oh, that assault infantry was a savage. Okay, killed. Mm-hmm. Okay. So I'm not gonna opt out for HQ for right away since this is a short map and. You know, this map is renowned for HQ3, Zeus Torrent Rush, or Bunker Rushes. Okay, and so I'm not going to opt out for HQ4 right away. Instead, I'll go for HQ3, then slowly climb my way up to HQ4. Okay, here goes Weapi Wa An Hong's base. Construction yard over here, gun towers over here, and the scout revealing that this blue player is going to s straight to HQ4. Wow, okay, that's fast. Okay, now let's see what's happening here in the green player. As expected, Zeus Torrent Typhoon Rush with a bunker, with a rocket tower and a bunker to defend itself with. Now, the composition that VIP Wa An Hong went for is actually a semi gun tower rush with mammoths. Okay, now nice defensive line over here, nice positioning. And here goes. I'm gonna be attacking this green player, not giving him time to build up his army. And as you can see, force firing above the cliff does not reveal the units outside or above the cliff. Okay, here goes. And as you can see, while I am attacking, I am actually more focused on economy. As you can see over here, I have like 7 supply centers. And this Zeus will have to take care of this mammoth. And this Jaguar will have to go for the rescue. Oh, and wow, shield generator. Okay, at the 6th minute mark. Very fast, since he has level 4 HQ in the early battle. Or in the early stages of the game. And as you can see over here, two Jaguars made, made its way to rescue this mammoth. And slowly but surely saving up the resources using a gold resource boost. Wow, Typhoon. Okay. Three Zeus. Four Mammoths. And two gun towers just to kill three jaguars with a shield. And two porcupines. And then the torrent from the green player helping him out. Okay, let's go back in here. Force firing above the cliff is quite hard when the target is moving around. So it's better to deal with them. You know, like, uh, it's actually better to deal with those moving units above the cliff using manual or automatic targeting due to AI targeting. Okay, here goes. Going level 4 HQ right now. Heavy assaults are making its way over here. Additional gun towers from VIP Wa An Hong. And again, this mammoth is trying to be annoying as to fire artillery shots on that bunker from a safe distance. Okay. Mammoth's over here still trying to be annoying. Okay, let's see what's going on here. Now I have, I'm gonna be having level 4 HQ very soon, 30 seconds. Mammoth still, non-stop production, Jaguars as well. Mm -hmm. Here goes, I'm actually mounting a siege over here while actually gaining position of this cliff above here. And then having a Mammoth force fire on that factory. To be, of course, annoying as humanly possible. And then I'll, of course, uh, retreat. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, that Jaguar got picked off. Okay, here goes. As you can see, two Jaguars are ganging up on that Zeus. Okay. Force firing. So, as you can see, that Zeus can no longer fire on the Jaguar. Okay. Now, still, the siege here is going on. Now, both me and Wa An Hong are not giving the blue and the green player a time to breathe and develop their base. Okay, as they actually rush level 4 HQ, both of them. 
Okay, torrents are actually force firing above the cliff. They can actually guess where the units are coming from, or the salvos are coming from. Okay. Ah, uh, bam. Got killed. Okay, level 3, special vehicle factory for chameleons. <clears throat> a scout over here by this porcupine. A torrent over there. And so I'm gonna have to position my mammoths later on. And then this Zeus managed to get its way above the cliff. Okay, so I'm gonna have to, of course, rescue. Oh, and then a skirmish again. Five Zeus versus like, wait. Five mammoths. Okay, one got destroyed. Five mammoths, two jaguars, three gun towers, and two porcupines. Let's see. Okay. Though not of all of the gun towers are firing. Two of them are firing. Okay. Mm-hmm. Gold recovery boost, bro. That'll help. Okay. There it goes. Okay, now let's see here. A porcupine. Okay, on scout mode or hide mode. And then I had my Jaguars retreated since a uh, torrent is force firing on this location. Now, as you can see over here, Chameleon now in production. This Jaguar is looking into a good position. Uh huh. I was hoping to fire on that construction yard. Now, here goes the Mammoth trying to be annoying. Okay, there goes. Force firing on that torrent that is placed beside the construction yard. Okay. Now the Zeus managed its way above the cliff yet again. A Zeus will also try and kill the mammoths that are attacking. Okay. Okay, so managed to uh, somehow fend off the attack above the cliff. Building a rocket tower above the cliff, securing its position. But I won't allow that. The first chameleon is, has arrived or popped out already. And I'm going to have to use it for, you know, like to destroy the rocket tower that is being built. Three Jaguars were sieged about about here to, of course, rescue them two Mammoths. And the siege here is still going on. Wow, six Zeus. Bruce, some of the Zeus are bruised up. Okay, a Torrent, a help from the green player. Okay, let's see here. Mm. Okay, that was four Mammoths, a Gun Tower. Okay. Ooh, a Jaguar. Okay. Okay, managed to fend it off since uh, some of the Zeus has low HP. Okay, here goes. Oh man, oh, live, come on. Oh, there it goes, it lived. Okay, very nice. Here goes again the siege over here and the siege over here. So I'm attacking this green player from both this side and this side, not giving him a chance to breathe. So, you know, I'm like. Keeping him occupied under constant pressure. Now, two torrents made its way over here. The units are quite clumped up or badly positioned. Now, this uh, gun tower will now have to help out or this jaguar will now have to kill. Oh, man. <laughs> that one rocket, man. Okay, here goes. Nice sieging units above here. And then, let's see here. A Zeus will force fire on the cloud. Due to the explosion radius of the Zeus, as you can see, two Jaguars are bruised up. Let's see what'll happen. Okay. Killed one, two Jaguars. Okay. Very good for that Zeus. Okay. Still, the siege is ongoing here and are laying siege to this headquarters around there. Now, three Jaguars and two Mammoths are about there. Around there. And then I'm actually building my momentum. Okay, keeping my units alive in the process. Now, as you can see over here, I got like four supply center. Now have five ma five Jaguars and three Mammoths and six Jaguars actually. Okay, now this sieging attack is, you know, like building barracks beside the, bu beside the unit. Once the barracks finish, it can reveal the unit. Now, a uh, building under construction cannot reveal a unit. Just uh, keep that note. Okay, again, the siege over here. Okay, and my chameleon was sent over here. I actually activated it to help out via Piwa Anhong, and that HQ is dangerously low. Wow, a Thor popped out. Okay, wow. Okay, so yeah, HQ is getting dangerously low. 
Oh, come on, man. Kill it. Oh, just one shot away. Come on. Just one shot, man. One shot. Come on. You can do it. Ah. He just has to retreat since there's like doors. Oh, man. <laughs> okay. Here goes. I'm go actually going into a position where I can lay siege or attack this green player. Okay. And once again... Oh, the uh, HQ or the headquarters are repaired or under repair. Okay. Very nice save by the blue player though. Okay. Now let's see what's going to happen here. I'm actually producing or building a construction yard above the cliff. Okay, here goes the siege. Okay. Alright, now let's see what will happen here. Due to lag, I was not able to micro my chameleon very nicely. Hopefully, or fortunately, I actually killed the rocket tower that are that were built over there. So that allowed me to kill the uh, torrents. If not, then that those uh, that rocket tower can like shred this jaguars to pieces since there's like they're like clumped up. Okay, I'm gonna have to retreat. Waited for this chameleon to arrive. Okay, and again another bomb from the Thors. What an intense battle this is. Okay, now. This is actually the reason why, at you know, if you go HQ4 right away, you'll be attacked by this kind of cheese tactics. You know, they'll rush you once they found out that you rushed HQ4. So if you're going to our HQ4, you need to deny the scouting as much as possible because you will have less on the ground to defend yourself with. Okay, and here goes. Let's see what will happen here. Now, I don't know for whatever reason, this green player went for HQ4 himself. He doesn't even have CP. You know, like a command point of units to defend himself with. You know, if I were him, I would have built up my uh, my command points for Torrents and Zeus. Then, once I have enough, around 80 command points, I'll go for HQ4. Okay. Here goes, I'm gonna go ahead and siege up this base, but I'm wary of those tar, uh, Thors, okay, bombers. So I'm them moving them around, but regardless, they actually managed to get a good hit. Okay, oh man, oh. Okay, now here goes, I'm gonna have to try myself, you know, try and kill that HQ4. Oh man, that hammer. Okay, second factory over here. Oh, VIP Wa Anhong is like, you know, telling me to go over here with this chameleon to cover himself. To help me cover himself with my chameleon. But I was busy microing around. As you can see, I built two Avia Factory. Producing units. While those stores are attacking me. So I need to constantly move my army around. And build or micro, or macro my building. And then produce units at the same time controlling everything all at once so it gave me a hard time hence the micro on this chameleon was light okay here goes I see and then the chameleon will not activate oh man it did not activate ah uh, what a blunder no that chameleon did not really activate at all even though it has half energy oh man <laughs> Okay, here goes my siege over here. I actually went back once those I saw those spores bombing So technically they'll have to refuel For the next bombing run now here goes. I'm gonna have to focus fire on Some of the heavy assaults that are heading my chameleon's way. Okay again. The Thors are bombing Okay, come on man. Come on. Oh No, no, no mm. Nice what a hero. Okay, you should be promoted, man. Okay, here goes. Actually, this blue player was building up the momentum of his Zeus. And two shield generators are actually going to push back VIP Wa Anhong. Since there's like... You know, the gun towers has been bombed. But luckily, VIP Wa Anhong has Hawks. Okay. There goes the bombing runs of those stores. Nice bombing run. Okay, killed the the uh, shield generator which was bruised up. Okay, now heading straight towards the Zeus. Okay, but he is still getting pushed back. 
Now, once I saw this, I actually planned to move my army to help out VIP Wa and Hong. Okay, here goes. But those Zeus are nearing its end. Okay, so it's gonna get destroyed by those hawks since it doesn't have a typhoon to, you know, accompanied with it. Okay, now those stores are gonna have to scout the base while damaging this power plant over here. And a jaguar that was placed over there destroyed the, the power plant. So now the uh, blue player does know that there's like an airfield over here. And we're gonna go ahead and check it out here over real quick. Now, as you can see, I'm trying to switch tactic here going to... Hawks, okay, a chameleon over here, of course. Now let's see what will happen here. VIP Wa Anhong will go for HQ4. This uh, power plant is about to die. Okay, come on, man. Okay, four hawks. Now I have the six, the fifth, and the sixth hawk is in production. Now mammoth still. Okay, as you can see, I saved resources for another chameleon, and I'm going to head over to attack this green player yet again. Now let's see here, those stores actually killed the ABF factory, so no more hawks for VIP Wa An Hong. Okay, now let's see what'll happen here. Four assaults and a hammer, we're not actually doing good versus my army. It simply lacks the number. Okay, very nice. Now building inside the fog, waiting for the building to finish to reveal. Okay, now this the fifth and the sixth hawk is about to pop out. Okay, non-stop unit production. And let's see over here. I'm going to attack this green, this green player from this side and kill the HQ again. I'm going to go ahead and try and do that and see wait, if I can do it. Okay, let's see if I can. Now there are Thors, keep in mind. So I'm going to have to move my army around. There it goes. Oh man. Oh, <laughs> nice. Nice. Okay, we managed to evade all those bombing runs from those four Thors. And I'm gonna focus fire on that HQ. But I need to move my army around as this building will finish soon. So I'm gonna have to move my army around yet again. Okay. So I'm gonna have to try and force my way over here, killing that HQ. Force firing on it. Now focus firing on it. Oh man, could not kill it since those Zeus are in position and can kill the fog. Or kill the units inside that are clumped up along with those stores so I really need to retreat okay here goes my Hawks now this HQ is bruised up gonna have to kill it since the blue or the green and the blue player has yet to scout my base and see if I have any Hawks or anything like that now I'm gonna go for the H the airfield which those stores are docked into okay Nice pick off over there and killed two ha uh, two Thors in the process. Now this green player does have a vertex. We're gonna go ahead and see. We're gonna have to kill that beautifully, beautifully done, wonderful. Now I'm gonna have to send a small detachment over here to help secure the base of VIP Wa An Hong as well as attack if needed. Okay. Some Zeus actually managed to come over here, but I'm gonna have to help kill it. Then there's like a you know, like a guard over there. Very nice. Okay. Going level 5 HQ. Since, again, I have enough skill points. Or actually, commands, command points. Or army, rather. That are under my command. Okay. I now have 7 Hawks in total. VIP Wa An Hung is getting into position to attack. VIP Wa An Hung also instructed me to go over this. So we can both attack the, the blue player from two sides namely from this side and this side okay while I on the other hand has three Jaguars over here will be attacking this side and this side so actually we're attacking the I'm actually attacking both players at the same time from multiple angles now you did see here a clash of Zeus VIP Wa An Hong managed to actually lure those Zeus away my Hawks are now gonna go ahead and support okay and now this army of mine will now have to make its entrance. I'm gonna have to try my best and kill as many Thors as possible since they are expensive and kill Zeus in the process along the way. Now VIP Wa An Hong will also move around here. Okay. I'm gonna have to focus fire my uh, Jaguars over there. Now as you can see over here, two detachment destroyed the bunkers over here and some of the buildings that are over here. 
Okay. Now still the siege is non-stop. Okay, not giving the both the players a time to breathe. And as you can see over here, two chameleon will now have to be annoying as well as mine. I'm gonna have to force fire or focus fire my jaguars here on that factory. Now those Zeus are gonna be a pain, some uh, or Thors are gonna be a pain, so I'm gonna have to retreat. And also there's like Thor, so I'm gonna have to constantly be on the move. Come on. Alright, so destroying some of the administration buildings, walls are now going to be built. Now let's see here, building inside the fog, waiting for the building to finish, but I'm going to have to destroy it anyway. Okay, had my army retreat, since this chameleon is about to run out of energy, I'm going to have to recharge it, then go back in again. Okay, one chameleon ran out of energy, I commanded the other to activate, but did not activate. Oh man, what a blunder. That chameleon bug really is annoying. For a long time now. For two months, rather. Okay. Okay, now this vertex is trying to be annoying. I actually saw my nuclear launcher over there. And I got, like, enough resources to produce a nuclear. There it goes. Okay, VIP Wa Hung. Wow, nice bombing run from, by that tour. And then, the airfield got destroyed. So, there, there's no longer tours into the game. Unless, oh, there's, like, actually an airfield yet again over there. I'm going to have to retreat this army over here. Okay, now let's see here. How many hawks do I have? I only have one hawk left. Okay. Now let's see here. VIP Wa Anhong is like killing the uh, HQ and the rocket tower. Without any defenses. Dude, those doors? Oh man, nice bombing run. But did not kill all the units as it was not accurate. But managed to kill the chameleon. Okay, here goes. Okay, this uh, chameleon actually recharged its energy, and at the same time, going to be moving in here. And as you can see, nuclear just less than 20 seconds away from being launched. Okay, and so here goes the attack, attacking both players at the same time. VIP Wa An Hong will now have to somehow help me out with the attack. Okay, he actually got the cue. Alright, so I managed to somehow catch the salvos of those torrents that are actually placed over there, giving VIP Wa An Hong the time to attack the blue player. Here goes, nuclear now going to be launched, and I'm going to be attacking this green player, but I don't have the number of Jaguars, so I'm going to have to retreat a little bit. Here goes. Oh man, that, those torrents really gave, it, gave us a hard time, and here goes. Bam. Okay, killed a lot of buildings, including the HQ. Now this chameleon is just the sole survivor of that detachment. Okay, I'm gonna have to, you know, like kill this assault over here. Now let's see what's gonna happen here. Two hawks in production, jaguars in production. Okay, reinforcing this uh, detachment over here. Another reinforcement from BIP Wa An Hung finishing the job. Okay. Again, we're constantly putting pressure on both players. They actually made a mistake of going HQ4 right away. If they hadn't go HQ4 right away, went for Zeus and Torrent, they would actually give us a hard time since... No, Resistance on level 3 HQ always have a hard time versus Zeus and uh, Torrent. Okay, there it goes. My Hawks are now going to go on ahead and help them out. Okay, nice. I actually love that scene where it killed the uh, Vertex, very good. Okay, now this attack over here is now uncontested. And I believe at this point, both the players already left the battle. Alright, and that's gonna be JG, and I'm gonna go on ahead and of course finish my contract. But, to no avail, I actually forgot my contract. Yeah, GG. VIP Wa An Hong is Imba. Yeah, good fight. Okay, good battle. Very intense. Okay. Here goes. Alright, so I'm gonna have to clean up this uh, green player's leftover. And produce grenadiers. Okay, mammoths as well. Okay. And I actually forgot my contract. <laughs> Alright, so that's gonna be it for this video. And again, if you'd like the video, please give this video a thumbs up. Subscribe on my channel and turn on the notification to not miss an upload or stream from my channel. Might as well visit my other 
my previous videos so as they contain tips and tricks with English commentaries that may help you win a battle. And again guys, thank you for watching. Have a great day and good luck with your battles. Bye now.